My dearest Josephine, I thought I saw you today and it brought me joy. Hey, the Godfrey's. It's the perfect romance. It's a shame it's not a real story. Too perfect. You know, you should enjoy a true perfect story when you hear one. Lord Andrew loved her so much. And Lady Josephine, she really was a style icon. You know, she's the reason I first got into design. Time to send it over to the big boss herself. Hey, Isabella. Your job will be to design a signature dress for the Godfrey Centennial Gala. Erwin Jefferson, curator of the Godfrey Manor. You. you. Blake here has been hired to make a film celebrating the Godfrey anniversary. Everything in this house holds real significance to the story. Why don't you be my tour guide for the day? Walking through the Godfrey story could help you find the right design. Lord Andrew Godfrey fell in love with the maiden of the house. Josephine was standing next to a statue of Aphrodite. She took his breath away. We just need a little reenactment footage. Action. You get the perfect stand-in for Josephine. Keep your eyes on the road. Okay. Oh! Did you get that? That's a shot. <laughs> He's a little bit charming. It's like he can't take anything as it is. Don't you find this a little too on the nose? The famous Godfrey letters of love. So do you think they had a spy code? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. This room has great significance. These are all markers of adventure for the Godfreys. Great love is built on these moments. I'm really happy that I'm able to be able to share this with you. The guest of honor, the last surviving Godfrey relative. I love it. You are the only one who's truly understood. Thank you so much, Miss Godfrey. I found a letter. Josephine briefly fell in love with someone else. You only care about poking holes in things. All you do is bury yourself in this story because it's easier than putting yourself out there. I've loved this story my entire life. You can't hold out for a perfect romance. It doesn't exist. The Godfreys don't have anything on you. Being here with you has changed me. I've fallen for you.